Hey guys, welcome back to another Tea Time video. If you're new here, I'm Chenille, aka No Mediocre 876. And on this channel, I do health, travel, food, and lifestyle videos. So after watching this video, go ahead and check out the other videos which are on the channel. Also, if you're new here, click the subscribe button right now. Turn on, turn on your post notification bell so that you don't miss any video I post on the channel. And of course, you'll become a part of the No Mediocre family. So today guys, we'll be talking about the herb Penny Royal, scientifically known as Mentha Pulgium. So guys, this herb has been used for centuries in wines, food and of course to make a tea. The aroma of pennyroyal is very much similar to that of mint. Additionally, pennyroyal was used as a traditional herb and folk remedy to stimulate menstruation. However, in higher doses, it will induce abortion. One thing I want you to note though guys, pennyroyal oil should not be in ingested. It is toxic. Okay guys, it is toxic without further ado let's get right into making our penny royalty and discuss the health benefits that you can get from drinking penny royal tea let's get right into it this is my penny royal herb it's actually in the dried form All right guys so when i got it 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 didn't look like this so i washed it and i placed it in the sun um, and allowed it to dry Right, so you know that when you dry your herbs, it actually lasts longer. So, what I'm going to do now, guys, is I'm going to wash it, which, although it was already washed. I'm going to wash it again, and I'm going to use two teaspoons of the herb to make the tea. Hopefully, I can get two teaspoons out of this. But yeah, guys, um, this is how it looks in the dried form. <laughs> Pennyroyal belongs to the mint family and is also commonly known as European Pennyroyal, Squaw Mint, Mosquito Plant, and Pudding Grass. The plant is native to Europe, parts of Asia, as well as the Middle East. However, it was introduced to places in Africa along with Australia and New Zealand. Now, let's look at some of the health benefits of Pennyroyal. Number one, treats cold or flu. Pennyroyal consists of high menthol content and has been used over the years for its expectorant qualities and its ability to relieve the symptoms of colds or flu. It may also aid breathing and act as a decongestant for the respiratory system and the lungs. Number two, for digestion and stomach pain. Pennyroyal has been used to improve general digestive health and to treat several common digestive complaints. Small doses of the tea can help treat bloating, gas, or stomach pain. The plant also has antispasmodic actions that can help soothe stomach pain or cramp. Number three, it helps you relax. Pennyroyal may have mild sedative properties. It was used in the past to combat hysteria and may help to calm the nerves and help people overcome their difficulties with sleeping. However, there is no evidence that Pennyroyal works beyond the anecdotal. So, it's best to use other natural researched options for dealing with stress and sleeplessness. Number 4. Promotes Menstruation Pennyroyal is well known for its aminogog activity. It has been used throughout the years to help stimulate menstruation in women with irregular cycles or in those who do not menstruate at all. However, there are many alternative options to encourage menstruation, many of which are safer than pennyroyal. For this reason, most experts would not recommend using pennyroyal for this purpose. Precautions Pennyroyal should never be used by pregnant women or nursing mothers. It can cause uterine contractions 
and an increase in menstrual flow and significantly increase the risk of abortion. Avoid if patient has fits or seizures and those with liver or kidney disease. Nursing mother should avoid pennyroyal as it may mix with the breast milk and may cause complications for the newborn baby. While it does have amazing health benefits when used by adults in moderate doses, it can also be toxic in higher doses. Due to the possible health issues, it is always best to consume pennyroyal under the careful supervision of your general practitioner. Alright guys, our penny royalty is served. Leave a comment below and let me know if you'll be making this tea or if it's your first time knowing about this tea. Cheers to all the benefits that we will get from Penny Royal. So good. Don't forget to hit that like button right down below guys. Share this video and of course subscribe if you haven't subscribed as yet and turn on your post notification bell so that you won't miss any video I upload on the channel. Cheers.